vehicle that has a red sticker that says Marine Corps Security Force Company, all initials. Do not take any pictures of my antenna systems. Do not take any pictures of, of uh, my Humvees that are rolling through up here. Everybody understand? A little bit of history of uh, how we got this uh, base here in, uh, in Cuba. From 1511 to 1898, Cuba is a Spanish, is a Spanish colony. In 1898, we had the Spanish-American War. From this war, what we got out of it is known as uh, the Platt Amendment. The way I interpret the Platt Amendment is basically a lease. The Cubans are, along, are allowing us to lease the naval base here, everything that we have here. Um, Another thing, <clears throat> all of this was constructed. Sir, gentlemen, do you mind coming back over here? If I could have you guys join the group over here. Thank you. Camp 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6, and we'll be touring those camps. Essentially, here is the camp distribution. We have 25% detainees there. That's the most, that's a non-compliant camp. We have approximately 45% at Camp 6, 5% at Camp 1, and 25% at Camp 4. What's up? How are you? Uh, let's see, uh, are you filming right now? Yeah, is that alright? Okay. Can I ask what your official uh, title, job title is? I'm the OPSEC Program Manager, Operations Security Program Manager. Okay. Okay, uh, once we get inside the camps, uh, you know, there's a lot of places you can't take pictures of. You can actually get some pictures of the detainees, but you can't get their face. You can't have multiple towers. You can't have unoccupied guard towers. Okay, you can't show any of the guards' faces. All right, so there's a lot of great pictures you can get. Even pictures of the camp right here where it says no photographs. Yeah. Uh, locking mechanisms. Do not get locking mechanisms. I'm glad you'll see you point that one right there. Locking mechanisms on the gates. Oh, the locking yeah. itself. Locking, okay. locking mechanisms are the keys. Uh, like I say, multiple towers, unoccupied towers. Lock the guards, off. Watch the uh, guards' faces. Watch the faces of the guards. These kind of towers, if they're occupied, mm -hmm. that tower over there, but the, and then the concern is because there's a security mm -hmm. camera alongside it, you don't want to get that, but mm -hmm. um, just be more conscious because these are the guard towers and this is kind of a I'm, something different. I'm, something different, yeah. Right. I'm, I'm not really sure what it is. When you go through the camps, we're going to give you time to look around. Uh, you're taking uh, video and, and photographs and I'm sure you've been briefed on do's and don'ts on those and all of that will be vetted, cleared before you, you're allowed to take any of those images. But uh, our intent is to give you the opportunity to see as much as possible uh, what's going on on the camps, because I know that's what you came to see, so you can tell the story to the world. Okay, a couple things I'd like to point out here. One, this uh, gives you the opportunity to see exactly what uh, um, one of the bays where the detainees live, um, just minus the desk. Um, you, know, they, you know, they have the beds in here. Um, the second thing I'd like to point out is throughout your tour today, even in the uh, wreck that we were just at outside, uh, there is an arrow throughout all the camps uh, pointing towards Mecca. These are some of the items that they are issued. Um, here as you see the uh, you know, prayer beads, the prayer cap. Um, you will see that you know we have movies here. So the detainees come in. Um, they have the opportunity to, to choose from some soccer, uh, National Geographic, uh, Discovery Channel uh, type movies. And also we have some Disney movies here. Um, Seems the favorite movie that uh, the detainees like is from the Discovery Channel, and that is The Deadliest Catch, the King Crab up there in Alaska. So, uh, um, you know, that's one that they, they really enjoy. Most of the movies are in English, but some of the movies, as you see right now, do have subtitles on them. Um, you know, so it gives the you know, detainees the opportunity to exactly, uh, you know, understand, you know, what's going on in the movie. <laughs> This is what we call is uh, our open wreck or uh, 